Hey, good morning, everybody. I am Sue Brooke coming to you live from Sebastopol, California in beautiful Sonoma County. How are you doing today? I am excited to talk about ears today. <laughs> Why am I talking about that? Oh my goodness. Okay, so here's the thing. I am sort of debated on whether I wanted to talk about this or not, but um, I thought, you know what, I'm going to because um, it kind of goes into some things that I teach when it comes to business and marketing and sales and, and growing your business. So let's talk about ears right now. <laughs> All right, so I want to look and make sure that I am set the right way here. All right, so here's the thing. I just got hearing aids. Yep, I did. You can't really tell. There are these kind of cool ones that go behind your ear and a uh, little thing stuck inside there. So you can't really tell and no one would know unless I told them besides I have hair over my ears. So uh, I actually got myself some hearing aids this week. It's very bizarre. I would love to know if any of you have ever do, actually wear hearing aids or have tried them before. But oh my goodness, it is very bizarre. Okay, so why did I get hearing aids? Okay, well, first of all, I do have some hearing loss. Those of you who know my story, my rock star story, I was married to a musician for 13 years and around a lot of rock and roll music. So <laughs> that's probably uh, a big part of why I have a little moderate hearing loss. Um, and again, I'm sorry for the internet connection. I can tell I'm a little, a little uh, shaky here. So anyway, hopefully you can hear me. All right, so. Post below if you have tried hearing aids or you have them or have any sort of hearing loss, I would love to know about that. So why am I bringing that up? Well, first of all, um, it's been an eye-opening experience because part of my hearing loss is the high registers, the THs, the SHs, the higher register, the higher, um, you know, high, high, what do you call that? <laughs> anyway, that's the part that I have the hearing loss in. So when I'm talking, I feel like I'm on a microphone and I can hear all those high-pitched things. Um, the microwave, when it was beeping, sounds totally different. And uh, yeah, it's, a, it's very interesting to get used to this whole hearing aid thing. Anyway, so I thought, well, how can I talk about that and correlate that with what I talk about with and what I teach with marketing and sales and business, okay? So <laughs> I have to tell you a story. So when I had my tutoring business and we had to talk to and listen to a lot of potential clients, which if you're in business, you have to listen to people, right? And I talked about all the time. I used to have someone that worked for me that wouldn't shut up. She would just talk, 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 talk and tell the person all this stuff when all the parent wanted to do was talk about their kids. And when you are talking or say in sales or you want to sell something in your business, you need to listen and there's a reason why we have two ears and one mouth you know so i have this this uh, picture of this dog okay there's my cat who also has two ears, ears and one mouth luckily he didn't meow very much anyway going back so i have this picture of this dog that has gigantic ears and a little tiny mouth so when you're in business i want you to think about that picture big giant ears and a little tiny mouth okay you need to listen listen to your clients listen to what they want they will tell you what they need and what they want they will tell you if you would just listen a lot of us want to run off at the mouth and talk about ourselves and talk about our business and all these great things that it does but if we don't open our ears and listen to what they're saying maybe what work what's coming out of our mouth and what we think is important to them or what we think is important to us that so should be important to everyone it might not resonate with the person that you're talking to your prospect right so shut up and listen <laughs> and i promise you you will hear more than you anticipate and it will really help you in your business okay so listen all right and uh, i'm on a little bit of a rampage this week i guess yesterday i was talking about appreciating your clients and how important it is to do that and uh, if you really listen to them you'll find out that they they want to be appreciated they want somebody to listen to them and if you take the time to care about your clients and build a relationship and care about them and listen to them they will be your raving fans for life i promise you so go out there today and when you're talking to your prop 
prospects or your clients or people that are around you, just listen today. Listen and find, and you will hear things that will bring more ideas and more thoughts and and um, all those things to your to your prospects, your friends, anyone. So let's talk about hearing. Let's talk about um, hi there, Mary. How are you guys doing? I'm looking to see who's on there. Um, anyway, next thing I have to get glasses. I actually do. <laughs> you know. I, I turned 56 this week. It's like everything is going to hell in a hog basket. Anyway, you guys have an awesome day. Go out there and listen and think about those ears. You have two ears and one mouth, and uh, it will change your life, seriously, if you start doing that. All right. Have an awesome day. Bye, guys.